Greetings everyone, this is Danny from hardtravel.com, your luxury all-inclusive experts, and today I'm at the beautiful Sandals Regency Latak. Now this incredible resort is set on the cliffs of Latak Bay. It is absolutely stunning. You're gonna love all of the different restaurants, pools, the beach, and of course, the amazing views. That's one of the reasons why people pick this particular resort. You have these incredible suites up here on the bluffs where you get unparalleled views. Follow along as we tour this beautiful resort. Now let's start off at the beautiful beach that they have here, but before we explore that, I just wanted to point out this is a great place to check out the makeup of the resort itself. So it's set in a little bit of a valley, it's framed with cliffs on one side and the other, and that's what makes this so special, is the incredible views from the rooms and throughout all of the different restaurants and things in the resort. But from here you can see all down the edge there, those are part of the resort as well. Those are different suites, you've got the incredible millionaire suites up there, and as you work all the way up and around, you can kind of see it creates a horseshoe bay concept. So you've got more buildings just behind me, but this is what is framed in, this stunning beach. We're actually at high tide right now, so this is the smallest that the beach gets. Throughout the day, it's gonna kinda go out a little bit further so it gets even bigger. And then you can walk right out into that beautiful crystal clear water and have a nice warm bath, if you would. That's about the temperature that it is. Now along the beautiful beach, you're gonna have these day beds set up. There's also loungers. They'll bring some umbrellas down a little bit later as well too. But one of my favorite things is if you're staying in one of those butler level suites, they're actually gonna set this up for you even before you wake up. So you sleep in, get up when you want, you come on down and utilize the space. You're gonna have your cooler stocked exactly to your preferences. But this massive beach is open to anyone at the resort, of course, and you're gonna love it for so many reasons. You've got the water sports on the far side, you've got the entire resort wrapped around it, but I don't know, if you love walks on the beach, this is a perfect one. Now when Sandals says that they're all inclusive, they really mean that. That also includes all of these incredible water sports opportunities. You've got kayaks, Hobie cats, sailboats, stand up paddle boards. They even have the ability to head out and do all kinds of different water sports out on the bay. So you can go snorkeling and of course, scuba. Now scuba is such a unique inclusion. Most companies do not include that. It is a complimentary feature. Now, if you're already certified, all you have to do is come down, schedule your time, head on out and explore the beauty that is St. Lucia. They have some incredible dive sites around here. If you're not certified, you actually can get certified while you're down here. They even have a dive pool where you can practice in and then head out whenever you're ready. Another one of those fan favorites is snorkeling. Once again, a complimentary inclusion. So now we're set just behind the dive shop. I love that they have that map that shows all of the incredible dive spots that they utilize from here on the resort. And I mentioned earlier the dive pool. So you can see they're actually in here getting certified right now so you can practice, get to your comfort level so you can go out and have an incredible swim. Just behind me, you can see these three beautiful beach cabanas. You're set just above the beach, just a few steps down if you wanna head into the water. But these are ones for extra cost that you can reserve. It's such a fantastic option, they go really quick. My high recommendation is that you check that out as soon as you arrive here on property. But you can see here, they have the coolers, they'll stock it exactly to your preference. They do have the curtains that come down for a little bit more privacy. But what I love about this spot right here is I feel the breeze in my face. You can sit, relax, you're perched just off the ocean. So you can head down if you want, stay up here. And then you're also just a few steps away from Neptune's and Bella Napoli. And you can even order from those menus directly to your cabana. Now as an extension to the spa, they have this fantastic beachfront gazebo. It's incredibly popular and you can imagine why. You can come here and get a nice couple's massage, get that breeze coming in and really experience everything that the beach has to offer. Just up from the beach, you're gonna find the main pool area and just like every Sandals resort, it's the beating heart of the resort. You can see you have the beautiful pool behind me. It's really large. You've got bench seating that wraps all the way around. The pool actually continues all the way in the far distance. And we'll take you over there in just a second. But what I wanted to point out right here is in addition to the hot tub that, well, very, very popular, you've got a bar right here. So it's kind of a throughout the day kind of thing. It'll open up early in the morning and it goes into much later in the evening. You've got bar seating, you've got lounge seating as well. And it's kind of a spillover for pavilions, which is the breakfast, lunch, and dinner buffet type concept. But behind me, you're gonna find the swim up bar and every great all-inclusive has to have a fantastic swim up bar. The bartenders there are such an incredible amount of fun. They're gonna keep you smiling, laughing, and of course, most importantly, they're gonna keep those drinks flowing. Now set just behind it is an entertainment stage. So that's used throughout the day. So they're gonna have music around this pool. Keep in mind, this is gonna be one of the louder venues throughout the day. And that's intentional because there's other spots as well that we'll take you to that are a little more relaxed and chill. 
but in the evening they also use it for entertainment as well. They set up entertainment around the pool. So this is gonna be the area if you are looking for some action, you're gonna to wanna to hang out. Now from the other side of the pool, I wanted to point out a couple things. You can see once again, that swim up bar wraps all the way around. You can see pavilions just behind me. And up top there is the Cricketers. It's a fantastic pub option we'll get to in a bit where you can have food and of course drinks with friends. You might be seeing a theme throughout the resort here. As we continue along, you've got the large pool area. You see they have loungers set all the way around it. But one thing I love about this pool too, is you have all of the loungers set here along the beach. Now it's up above. So it's just a couple steps down to the beach, but it's really nice angle here where you can sit. You've got the umbrellas as well, if you want to utilize those, or you can just sit, relax. And all I hear right now are the beautiful waves and looking out at the beautiful bay in the distance. Now this is a really large pool. They utilize it for all kinds of things, including games. In fact, they had a kayak race in here yesterday. Everybody was really enjoying that. But the whole purpose of this pool is fun, entertainment, and hanging out with friends. Now we're on the far side of the main pool. You have another really large jacuzzi hot tub here set right on the beach. And then as we continue along, you see this is where they're gonna have the grotto waterfall portion of the pool. So it's all connected. You can swim right underneath the bridge there. They turned the waterfall off so it wouldn't splash us here today while we're filming, but it wraps all the way around. And it's just kind of a really cool concept to go in and out, very soothing. And you can even sit, there's bench seating behind it. So you can sit behind the waterfall as well. Now, just for a point of reference, behind me, there's a staircase that goes up to the main lobby. And then right up there, those windows are actually Le Toc French restaurant. Once again, a delicious choice, and we'll take you there in a bit. Now, all around the resorts, they have these small intimate areas set up. So behind me, you can see a fire pit right here. There's actually another fire pit over on the other side, but they're all around. The whole idea, before dinner, after dinner, just hanging out and relaxing. You can find that nice quiet spot for two, or if you have friends with you, or you meet new friends here, of course, as well. You're also gonna see one of the gazebos. There's several of them. They're used for all kinds of different things, maybe a romantic dinner. You can even use it as part of a wedding ceremony as well. Now, I wanted to point one thing out. Behind me, you can see some of the rooms. This particular resort has so many different room categories because it's actually set all up on the bluffs all the way around, including those incredible millionaire butler suites that are far up in the distance. Now, if you wanna check those out, make sure that you see the full tours on our channel in addition to this tour. Now, I did wanna point out too that they have these walkouts all around. So if you're one that wants to step on out and be right in the action, those may be a great fit for you. Now, perched up on top of the highest bluff here at the resort, you're gonna find the beautiful Sunset Pool and Bar Complex. So you see I have this fantastic jacuzzi hot tub, but the theme of this is everything phases directly out at that incredible sunset view. Now, wrapped around the pool itself, you're gonna find the different lounge chairs, umbrellas. There's also some tables as well. But what this is all about is this beautiful pool. You've got three great waterfall features, so you can swim underneath, you can stand underneath them well, maybe get a little bit of a massage. And then as you wrap your, around, you can also see that there's a horseshoe-shaped swim-up bar. Of course, the bartenders in there are fantastic. They're gonna keep the drinks coming. They're gonna keep you smiling. It's a fantastic place to spend part of your day. Now, just for point of reference, set just above is Armando's restaurant. Lunch and dinner, it's an a la carte Italian restaurant. And for breakfast, it's a la carte as well. So if you want that alternative buffet, you may want to head on up here. Tucked just underneath, you also have an additional loyalty and travel desk and a small red lane fitness center. Because wrapped all the way around this complex, you're going to find most of the butler suites. They're all up here. In fact, you're going to see a few of the areas set up with coolers. What that is, is you just let your butler know you want them to come down and set it up. They'll grab those chairs for you, they'll put the towels out, and stock the cooler to your preferences. But what I love about this particular pool is that you have the fantastic breezes coming up off the ocean, and throughout the day, it changes. So the sun starts on the far side, and as it moves throughout the day, you're gonna get a more and more beautiful experience. What I love most about this particular pool is that it's utilized from early in the morning until very late in the evening. In the morning, you can have that breakfast, take advantage of those beautiful views, and later in the evening, you can come and experience, wait, there's even more, these incredible lounges down below. So they have the tiers set up. So the first one you can see just behind me, there is a fire pit and loungers set all the way around. But in order to capture the magnificent sunsets that you find from this particular spot on the resort, it's tiered all the way down. You've got some bar seating areas where you're sitting and looking out. And then you have more couches, loungers, day beds. So you can tuck away to a private spot or share the incredible view with friends. So one of the concepts of this pool, in addition to all the incredible views, the bar and the pool, is that if you're staying up here, you have activities as well. So there's games that you can get, 
But what I like is they've got a ping pong table. You also have billiards set up in the distance. So really, you can stay up in this part of the resort, breakfast, lunch, dinner, pool, bars. It's a perfect place to be. Now we're inside my favorite restaurant here on site. It is Armando's Fine Italian Dining. And what's unique about this particular space is it's a breakfast, lunch, and dinner option. All three are gonna be a la carte, but what's unique about this is in addition to all of this beautiful inside decor, it is stunning outside. If you wanna start your morning with an a la carte option, this is a fantastic place to go. You can see all the different tables. They've got two tops and four tops. And then over here, it's kind of that hybrid where you're gonna see the open kitchen. I love an open kitchen concept. You get all of the fantastic smells. You get to see the incredible people back there who are doing amazing work to create that fantastic food. Now, what's unique about this, and not every single one has it, is you also have an a la carte lunch menu here as well. It's gonna be Italian, as you would expect in an Italian restaurant, and then if you want that fine dining experience for dinner, this is where you'll come as well. All of your favorites, that chicken parmigiana, the pasta dishes, the insalata caprese, everything that you come to love about Italian food, you can find it here. I love all of the different booths that they have, but my favorite part of this particular restaurant are the incredible views from the outside dining area. You're set all the way up on a bluff, you've got the pool down below, but all you see in the distance are the incredible views of the sea down below. Set just below Armando's and tucked behind the waterfall, you're gonna see the other bar that they have up here. So we saw the Sunset Swim Up Bar. This is the Sunset Bar. It's nice and air conditioned in here. You've got lounge seating along the side. You've got extra chairs as well. And then as you would expect, you can sit at the bar. So if you wanna come and have a cocktail before you head to dinner or after, or well, it's an all-inclusive just about any time, this is a great spot. One unique feature at this resort that you don't find at all the Sandals resorts is the butler lounge. So right up here on top of the Sunset Bar, you're gonna find most of the butler suites are wrapped all the way around here. And so this is that perfect spot where you can come in, work with the butlers. Of course, they're gonna be with you throughout your entire stay, taking care of every single detail. And I might mention, if you wanna see those incredible butler level suites, we have those on our channel as well. But what this is, is just a lounge area where you can sit, relax, maybe you're getting ready to depart, or you just come up and have a few questions. They also have some things that they can loan you as well but really just an extra perk for those of you who chose a butler level suite. All around the resort, you're gonna find unique and beautiful spots like this. This is perched just in front of the butler lounge and the sunset pool. You see here, they've got bar style seating. As you go around the other side, you have a nice shade structure and a couple tables and chairs. But what this is all about is sitting up above the incredible Latak Bay, looking down at the beautiful views. You've got the breeze coming up off the ocean and just enjoying vacation. So the final pool that we're gonna check out here is the Pitons pool. It's set with the Pitons restaurant behind it and Herbie's bar. This is one of the more relaxed areas here on the resort. It's kind of have that three village concept that we've been talking about. And this one is much more relaxed. You've got a large pool. You can belly right up to the far side of the pool there. And of course they have cocktail service all around. You can take advantage of those gorgeous views. You also have a hot tub option and set all the way around the pool. You're gonna have the loungers with the umbrellas. If you want some more sun, you can put that down. Of course, you can get shade as well. But once again, a very relaxed area where you can sit back. I can hear the waves lapping right now and enjoy your time. Now we're headed into Piton's restaurant. This is an elevated Caribbean concept. What I love so much about that is they're celebrating the locality of St. Lucia. You see the beautiful picture of the Piton's behind me. It's the mountains that are all around the island. Now, what this is all about is taking what the Caribbean is. It's truly a hodgepodge of all kinds of different cultures. You'll see some Indian influences. Of course, you're gonna see influences from Africa as well. And they've taken them and elevated them. The signature dish is a tamarind glazed pork tenderloin. They also have a fantastic Blue Mountain coffee rubbed uh, steak as well. But what, once again, this is a casual eatery. You get to take advantage of these incredible views from the resort. But if you're looking to dine in the style of the area that you're visiting, this is a fantastic option to choose. Now we're just inside Herbie's Bar. It's set just off to the side of Piton's restaurant. It's open in the evening. They have a fantastic patio and an indoor bar as well too. 
The entire theme is nautical in here. I love that they've got a picture of the Queen Mary for my personal family history. My grandpa actually came back over after World War II on the Queen Mary and my wife's grandma transited when she was a small child. So love that, just a little family history there. But as you look around the bar, you can see they've got the air conditioners in here, which is always nice. They open up the doors later in the evening and you get that breeze coming up off the ocean. But what this is about is having a cocktail before or after dinner, or just coming up and relaxing anytime in the evening. Our next restaurant on the menu is Le Toc French Restaurant. This is a classical French restaurant with elevated cuisine, a little bit of something for everyone, but if you love French food, you're gonna find something you love here, whether it's that escargot, well, I love a shrimp cocktail, filet mignon, or of course, chicken cordon bleu. They have a wide variety in here. This is one of the more formal settings, and of course, you get to take advantage of those incredible views out the front of the restaurant, but what you're gonna get here is fantastic service and French fine dining. Now we're at the entry area of a dual restaurant concept. So you have kimonos, which is an indoor teppanyaki experience. And then here you have soy, which is the sushi bar. It's always my favorite place. I'm just gonna say it for a pre-dinner. Well, you don't have to have reservations here at soy. I like to stop by in the evening and maybe have a little bit of sushi before I head to dinner. But of course you can also make it your full meal as well. You've got this outdoor seating right there with the, the tables. You've got the high top tables as well. And then of course the classic option at a sushi bar, you can sit right here at the sushi bar, watch the masters at their craft. But what's so unique about this incredible sushi bar, just like everywhere in this entire resort, you have incredibly beautiful views out to Latak Bay in the distance. So once again, you're gonna have all your favorite rolls, nigiri, sushi, sashimi, all of that here. And then of course the other option is kimonos. I'll take you inside. Now we're inside kimonos. You can get your first glimpse of these teppanyaki tables. And what I've found after doing this for 20 years, whether you're on a cruise, an all-inclusive or at home, this is one of those restaurant experiences that every single person loves because, well, there's something for everyone. And at this particular restaurant, I really love this lounge concept. You've got a lounge here. You also have some phenomenal seating outside to take advantage of the incredible views of Latak Bay. Now, of course, it's going to be a dining experience. So my high recommendation is to get here a little bit early. They've got a full bar, as you would expect. They'll mix you a cocktail. You can sit here in the air conditioning or step outside and take advantage of that beautiful breeze. And then after your dining experience, you can come back down, have another drink, relax with your friends, and enjoy everything that is wonderful about these incredible views here. Now, if you thought it couldn't get any better, they also have an upstairs to the restaurant as well. There's a total of eight teppanyaki tables. What I love about all the ones up here is they're all facing out at those incredible views. But once again, what I love about this restaurant is that it's totally customizable and something for everyone. Everybody loves fried rice, of course. You've got the chicken, you've got steak, shrimp, you also have some fantastic vegetarian and fish options as well. But whatever you dine in here, the whole thing is about the dinner and a show experience. The chefs are fantastic and you're gonna really enjoy your time here. Have a little bit of entertainment, a little bit of dinner, and then maybe head back down to that beautiful lounge for a cocktail. Two fantastic dining options here on the resort are Bella Napoli and Neptunes. They're both casual options. Right here is the pizza oven. You can see actually a couple of the butlers that are here picking up pizzas for the guests. But you can come here during the day. It opens later in the morning and early into the evening. You've got outdoor seating over to my right as well. So you can have that quick snack pizza if you want it, or you can turn it into a bigger meal with Neptunes. Now Neptunes has lunch service and also dinner service as well. It's completely outdoors. And what I love about this concept is that it's kind of narrow and long. And so there's great views from every single seat here. You've got the fans up above, you got the fantastic breezes coming off the ocean. What better place to take advantage of a seafood restaurant than, well, right here on the beach. So you're gonna find a mixed menu. Of course, you're gonna have some steaks and different things along those lines as well. The lunch menu is pretty diverse. You got everything from burgers to jerk chicken and everything in between. And then once again, later in the evening, it turns into more of a dinner menu. And of course, you can check out the dinner menus on sandals.com. If you wanna check our link down below, you can click on that link and navigate to all the different menus that they have here on site. So just below the lobby and with the pool wrapped all the way around it, you're gonna find pavilions. This is a breakfast, lunch, and dinner restaurant. It's a casual option. You've got the large buffet behind me. You've got the egg stations, all kinds of different areas set up for you. And then also in the lunch experience, it's also buffet. 
So I mentioned that it's dinner as well. If you want an ultra casual experience, this is a perfect stop for that. And when it's in season, the lobster here is absolutely fantastic. But once again, if you want that place where you can just grab and go, come and have a nice casual eat, this is the perfect spot for that. This beautiful space is the Cricketers Pub. Of course, it is a bar, as you would expect with pub in the name. They've got the full service bar here. They can pull a pint for you. And of course, all of your favorite different cocktail options. But what I like about this is it's also a dining venue, a very casual one. It's quite a fantastic space. You've got the high top tables. You've got some low tops around, two, four. They can put it together. You have more seating just through here. And they even have a little library tucked away as well. Now, what you're gonna find here is pub fare, those chicken wings. I also love that they have chicken tikka masala talking a little bit to, well, where cricket is probably the most popular in the entire world. You've got burgers, you've got all of those different classics. But if you want that late night fare, this is where you're gonna head. It's usually open till about two in the morning, opens early in the evening. Once again, a casual place to eat, gather with friends, have a drink and enjoy your vacation. As you'll find at quite a few of the venues here at this beautiful resort, they also have a fantastic outdoor seating area as well. So there's a couple tables around the corner, but what this is all about is the entire purpose of this resort, the way it's set, is to take advantage of those beautiful views out in the distance. Just off the lobby, you're gonna find the piano lounge right here. Every day in the evening, they're gonna have the pianist that's gonna play, nice relaxing music. And essentially what this is, is a place to come before dinner or after dinner, just to take in the ambiance. Now we're in the main lobby. And one of the things I love about this particular resort, as soon as you enter, you get those beautiful ocean views directly out to the front. Essentially, you've got chairs and seats all around, some sofas that are nice and comfortable. And you have the main check-in desk here if you're staying in one of the luxury level accommodations. Of course, if you're staying in one of the club levels, you'll head right to the Club Sandals Lounge. Or if you're staying in one of those butler levels, they're gonna take you right to your room to complete the check-in. Now, as we continue along, I wanted to point out the Island Roots desk right here. So this is where you're gonna head over when you're doing all of your excursions and review those details. But our high recommendation is that you let us take care of all of those even before you arrive. We can coordinate all the excursions. And of course, if you're gonna visit an incredible place like St. Lucia, we highly recommend that you step off the resort and do some exploration. But if we pre-book them, you don't have to worry about anything on your vacation. All you have to do is come on in, grab, talk to them, and they're gonna provide all the final details and you're ready to go. Now we're just inside the Club Sandals Lounge and what I like to think of this as is an extension of your living room when you're here on site. If you choose to upgrade to one of those club level rooms, in fact, this is where you're gonna go to be checked in. They're gonna whisk you right past the main lobby. You'll come in here, have a seat right there and the fantastic concierges, they'll check you in, but they're also available for you throughout your entire stay here. They also have several different things in here that I love. You can borrow games, books, and things like that. But you also have an espresso maker that you can utilize anytime that you'd like. You have a full bar here as well. And then essentially, like I said, what this really is, is it's one of those upgrade perks where they can make reservations for you. They can answer all your questions, but it's really just another way to raise the level of service here at Sandals. Just at the bottom of the lobby, you're gonna find the culinary concierge desk. This is where you can make reservations. And of course, if you have any exceptions that you need, special dietary requests, they're gonna take care of all of those details for you. And then of course, they can help you set up an ultra romantic dinner for two on the beach. But our high recommendation is that you let us take care of all of that even before you arrive. So you don't have to worry about anything when you get here on vacation. Sit back, relax, and have everything taken care of for you. Set just off of the lobby is the loyalty and travel desk. Now, if you're having an incredible time, as we know you will be, you might wanna stop by here while you're at the resort to book your next vacation. And what we love about that, we tell all of our customers to stop by because you can get special deals that you can only get here on the resort. Now, of course, as soon as you get back, reach out to us right away, that is very important. And then what we're gonna do is we'll take care of you from then on with every single step of the way. Whether it's a wedding, a honeymoon, or just wanting to explore another one of their incredible destinations, you see here in the Bahamas, all over Jamaica. We've got those videos as well if you wanna see the full resort tours. And then down in Antigua, well, St. Lucia where we are now, Barbados and Granada, wherever you choose for your next sandals or beaches trip, you're gonna have a phenomenal time and you're gonna to wanna to book here so that you can get the best deal. 
Now there's a great reason why so many of our guests choose to get married at Sandals Resorts. Their inclusions are the best in the industry and they've been doing romance travel and weddings for so long that they are incredible at it. They know the ins and outs and this particular resort is one of the most popular. You have a ton of spots on the on resort here for you to choose from. Whether you wanna have your toes in the sand down on the beautiful beach here or up on the Sunset Bluff, you've got those incredible tiered fire pits that we toured. And in addition to that, they have three gazebos that are set right on the beach. There's some lawn locations as well, but whatever it is that you're looking for, we're here to help you customize. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take care of all of your guests, all of your travel planning. You don't have to worry about any of that. We'll hook you up with the Sandals on-site wedding planners. They do an amazing job. As soon as you get back down here, you're gonna go right in. They're gonna confirm all the final details and make sure that your perfect day is exactly what you want it to be. So now we're just inside the wedding lounge. I wanted to point this out. You can just see some of the customizations that they have here, but Sandals has been doing weddings for so long and they are so incredible with romance that once again, you can customize your wedding exactly as you like. If you come down early to check out the property, you can come on in and meet with them here. Or when you arrive for your wedding, you're gonna come right in. They're gonna go over with a consultation one more time, review all the details to make sure that your perfect day is exactly what you want. Now, one of the reasons our customers love sandals and keep coming back time and time again is that they are the most inclusive of the all-inclusive brands. Here in St. Lucia, that includes golf. There's two fantastic options to choose from. You can golf at the Sandals Regency Latak. They have a great nine-hole course. And you can also take advantage of the Sandals Cop Estate Country Club, where they have a full 18-hole golf course as well. Your green fees are included and you're certain to have a great time. Once again, just one of the many choices that you have when you're staying with Sandals in St. Lucia. Another one of those outdoor active options you can take advantage of that's complimentary is tennis. So you see that they have three full-size tennis courts right here. They also have pickleball over in the corner. I do like that you have all of the lights. Of course, it gets pretty warm here in the middle of the day, and that's when I'm down at the pool. So maybe in the morning or later in the evening, you can turn those lights on and enjoy a game of tennis. Now, if you're looking for a little bit of retail therapy while you're here, they have the resort shop at Sandals. In there, you're gonna find different clothing items, sunglasses, things you may have left behind, sundries, sunscreen, and things along those lines. But what I love is they also have some island souvenirs as well. In addition, they also have the jewelry store over on the other side. So if you're looking for something a little bit more elevated, and of course, wanna take advantage of those duty-free prices, you can check that out as well. Now we're just getting ready to head into the Red Lane Spa here on site. You've got the spa over to the left, but I wanted to take you to one of the outdoor areas first. You see you've got the seats right here and then wrapped just around this beautiful cupola, you have the plunge pool. So you're gonna have a cold pool and you're also gonna have a jacuzzi as well. So the whole concept is that going to the spa is a journey. There's several different components inside and outside. Let me take you inside now. Now we're just inside the lobby. This is where you're gonna start your spa journey. You've got your check-in desk over to the side. You've got all the retail behind me. A lot of our customers tell us that's a great deal because they get duty-free prices, but you can decide for yourself. Now you've got the small sitting area, and then right here you're gonna find the makeup station. It's that perfect place if you're getting married on site, or you just wanna get made over before you head out for a nice romantic dinner. You can see they have a special light there as well on the mirror, I really like it. They can change it to see daylight and different kinds of color temperatures. So you can see what you look like, well, when you're gonna be out on the beach getting married if you'd like. As we head on through, we're gonna to get to the salon. So in here you have just about everything you'd expect at a salon at home. You've got the hair stations, there's several of them. You've got the pedicure stations with, well, giant tubs, so even my size 15 feet fit in there. And then the manicure stations all down the middle. So you can have any of those treatments if you'd like, or we get a lot of times the bridal party will take this over for a couple hours. They can all come in together, maybe have a glass of champagne, and really enjoy the entire experience. And we just entered the men's locker room. It's identical on both sides. You have the ladies on the other side and they have a unique configuration where all the treatment rooms basically have doors either way. So if you're doing a couples or a singles treatment, it works perfect for that. Now in the locker room itself, you see you have all the lockers. Inside the lockers, they're gonna have the towels, your robes, everything so that you can prepare for your treatment. And then over on the side, you're gonna have a sauna and a full steam room. Once again, on the ladies side as well. You've got the toilets tucked just around the corner, and then just through here, you're gonna find the showers. As we head down the hallway, just at the very end, you're gonna see that they have some of the bigger treatments rooms. So let me take you inside to one of the couple's rooms. 
Now this particular one is set up for a doubles treatment in one of the most romantic ways. You've got the beautiful bubble bath over in the corner. They have rose petals all around. They've got the candlelight and of course champagne on ice. Right here you can see you have the two treatment beds and then behind is the sink. They can do just about any different types of massages, facials, all of those kind of things. My personal favorite of course is the hot stone massage and I'm about ready. Is it time? All right, well, a few more minutes anyway. And then to cap it off, right around the corner here, you have a couple's shower, kind of one of those car wash showers where you got all the extra jets. But once again, you can move around, use the sauna, the steam room, of course, have a nice treatment and enjoy your wonderful massage. Now we're just in front of one of my favorite places to walk by at the resort. Nah, I'm just kidding. This is the gym. So if you want to utilize it throughout your stay, they have a very comprehensive one here. You've got all the cardio against the wall. You've got the treadmills, the ellipticals and bike. And then over in the corner, you've got the different circuit trainings. You've got the leg press over there. You also have a Smith machine. You've got the dumbbells in the corner. Want to get a little aggression out, you've got a boxing, uh, boxing bag as well. And then over here, you're going to have the different equipment. You've got the kettlebells, you've got the medicine balls. And then up top, you're going to have isn't that my desk chair? No, just kidding. Once again, uh, also in the corner, you have a Jacob's ladder. So you can see that it's very comprehensive. You can utilize it throughout your stay. And if you want to, you can also walk right by. First off, congratulations for making it all the way through the video. And thank you so much for spending your time with us today. Now this beautiful resort is perfect for so many of our customers. And now you can see why. The incredible millionaire suites, all of the different locations around the resort where you can take in the amazing views, the phenomenal beach, but of course the heart and soul of every resort is the staff. The employees here cannot wait to welcome you and create the incredible romantic vacation of a lifetime for you. Now when you're ready to book your next vacation, reach out to Heart Travel. We are your Sandals and Beaches experts. We know the spaces inside and out. We have an amazing relationship with Sandals and Beaches Resorts. And we know that we can craft the vacation of a lifetime for you, your friends, group, wedding party, or honeymoon at an incredible value. So that you too can take advantage of these insane views. Just real quick, make it a double. You're going to find me here for the rest of the day. Wow, look at those amazing views. Sold.